If there's one thing I've learned from both Bone Lab and Boneworks, it's that my arms exist beyond the physical limitations of any one dimension. Well, at least I got what I came for. The NPCs have been getting drunk on some kind of void melon juice. Oh, you don't feel so good after all those rum and cokes, do you? While those who haven't been getting drunk have clearly been suffering from some kind of serious hangover. Walk around, walk around. Guys, just, yeah, no, but you, come behind him, you. This, this way, continue, don't, don't walk straight though. You, behind him. And perhaps most importantly, that the best freaking puzzle I've ever completed in any VR game was a puzzle in Boneworks. Freaking love that puzzle, I hope they're all like that. And the game still tries to make me hurl from time to time. This is kinda cool. Okay, now it's, now it's kind of been going on too long. Now I'm not feeling so good. Second most importantly, according to all of you, was that I really, really needed to start using the super jump. All right, so everybody told me about the super jump, but I'm gonna go into slow motion. Wait, hold on. <laughs> hold on, I gotta press the jump button. Oh yeah, that felt super. Okay, so that must be the super jump. I liked super jumping so much that it got a little out of hand. Super jumping is fun. Ow. With this newfound power, I was able to bypass parts of certain puzzles and challenges. I feel like after you guys showed me the super jump, I can do anything. I could super jump over there, couldn't I? I could super jump to anything. Let's try it. I feel like this is too much power to give one man. Yeah, yeah, oh my gosh, guys. This game just got too easy. Oh, why do, I, why do I speak too soon like that every time? But the one challenge that can't be overcome with a super jump is jank. Yes, Where, what am I holding on to? Oh my God, I got it though. Oh yeah, got it. Ow, wait. Guys, how do, how do my hands get stuck in stuff all the time? What is it? What is it about my arms? My interdimensional arms. Let's just try and punch our way out of here. Oh God, I got both arms stuck in there. Both arms. Oh, oh, all right, one's free. One's free. Go with that. Come back. I came here just for you. You go there. Oh God. Oh God, it wasn't supposed to go there. <laughs> Boneworks, a game where the jank always corrects itself. Eventually. It's time to go Rambo mode on these motherfuckers. During this intense melee combat scene, I lost track of my real world position, a fatal error that would cost me about five minutes of intense throbbing pain in a swollen purple index finger. I just hit my wall and it hurt my hand really bad come on dude I just hit my wall got me some slack freaking hand is killing me now god my hand my dumb ass needed to take about a 10 minute break i'm back i had to uh I had to take a break and ice my index finger. When I hit the wall just now, it was mainly my index finger and it instantly became purple and instantly got swollen and it's kind of stiff. I'm glad I kept going because this next puzzle was a dime that's top of the line. Gravity! So I guess there's no gravity above this thing? Is that what they're saying? I feel like I should have done something cool down there, but instead I, I ended up just walking up here. Oh. <laughs> well, here I am, down down where I ought to be, I guess. There's nothing better than a good excuse to have to super jump. All right, looks like a good opportunity to use my super jump. Super jump time, super jump time. We should probably jump over there first and unlock that door. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. I could super jump to that ledge, but I'm gonna try and solve this puzzle the right way. Ready, set. Hey. The second try is always easier. 
Oh yeah, why didn't I just do this? Ha. Then I released the barrels of anti-gravity matter, which was like the meat and potatoes of this awesome puzzle. Now all those cans fell out. Yeah, it's anti-gravity waste. So we can put the anti-gravity waste under here, and it's gonna lift the thing up into the air. I like this puzzle. This puzzle is awesome. Um, on a scale of one to ten, I'm gonna give this puzzle the highest award I've ever rated any puzzle in Boneworks or Bone Lab. Ladies and gentlemen, I give this puzzle a nine point. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, seriously though, nine point four. Dude, that is freaking awesome. I'm gonna give it one more can just in case my body weight makes a difference. Oh. I almost thought that it wasn't gonna work. That was cool. That was the coolest puzzle I have ever completed in my life, my entire life in any VR game. Best best VR puzzle of all time. I need a drink of something. I'm my, so parched right now. One second. Finding all these null bodies who seem kind of drunk just really made me thirsty, you know? Then things took sort of a creepy turn as I found myself surrounded by undead versions of myself. Wait a minute. Shoot, dude, stuff got like supernatural all of a sudden. I feel like I should definitely shoot these things. I thought long and hard about whether or not I should attack those sleeping zombies before they all attacked me first. I'm so conflicted right now. I'm gonna do it. It wasn't a big deal at first because I hadn't actually shot anything yet. What just happened? One by one, they started standing up. Okay. <laughs> That was when I messed up. Oh. Oh, now I see why I said don't shoot. All right, we gotta get out of here. We gotta go. I got out of there in a slight panic, and then had to find my way through some scary underground tunnels. Hello? You don't look so healthy. You should try drinking some green juice or something, bro. Yeah, you shouldn't be glowing like that, my man. You've been eating at that McDonald's that's next to that nuclear power plant, haven't you? I told you not to eat there. Things have gotten a lot more intense in this game. Like, I frequently get jumped by entire gangs of enemies just waiting to take a cheap shot at me. Whoa. <gasps> wow. This crap is getting so intense. I love it. It's great. It was great when I had guns. But when I didn't have guns and only a crowbar to take out like 10 crablets at once, it was exhausting, but still great. Jeez! Oh my gosh. This is getting a little out of hand. How will I... How will I ever... Oh, not with him too! I hate these little guys now. You mess with the wrong Ford. I'm not like all the other zombies. I come back with vengeance in my heart. Fire in my soul. Gun here? I could've used that earlier. That was so good. If you enjoyed the video, tap that like button, subscribe if you want to stick around, and I'm going to see all of you in the next video. Peace. Um. Hmm. I have to clear all this out of the way. Uh, are these never going to open? Oh, they slide open, that's why. <laughs>